to let the public know that since uh, the election of Saturday, in which I participated as a double party candidate, that um, the, the results are still not being declared. And uh, I understand uh, uh, there is a game that is being played by the members of the INEC, you know, because at some point I, I got to know that uh, the declaration form for the House of Assembly election got missing. I think uh, uh, there, is, there is a kind of uh, a bias on the side of the electoral officer for the Mrs. Uh, uh, Oluchimosu, you know, because uh, uh, this election was conducted in a very, a, a very peaceful atmosphere. A set of few places that were that were crises, about one or two or three. I mean, about nine um, uh, polling centers where there were crises, which was not uh, enough to, you know, truncate uh, the announcement or declaration of the results. You know, from uh, 265 uh, polling units of uh, the new local government. Uh, so I am asking the public, I'm asking the resident, the resident electoral commissioner of Enugu State, to. Uh, as a matter of urgency, um, mandate uh, the returning officer for the as for assembly election to declare me the winner of the election. And uh, she has to do that because from there, from every statistics, I am leading the PDP candidate by almost 600 and something votes. I already got um, the, the statistics that the uh, Labour Party recorded about 9,994 9, votes. While uh, the PDP, you know, candidate got uh, 9,350 votes. So by that simple majority, I should be declared the winner of that election. I don't see any reason why this election should be delayed any further. The gubernatorial candidate in which a uh, contestant in that election, his results have been computed, and then uh, the, the, the results announced in his favor, that is in the favor of the Labour Party. So I don't see reasons why my own should be delayed. However, I know that there are very powerful people, you know, from Udain who are interested in that election, and that could be the reason why, uh, you know, the, 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 the electoral officer there is not helping out. As well, know that uh, one of the results, the result of Ubuntu award, has not been signed, and I begin to question whose duty is it to ensure that the results already prepared by uh, a staff of INEC, you know, should be signed so that it can be tendered, uh, tendered as a legal uh, document for that election. So these are the questions I'm asking. So I'm asking the public, the government, the INEC, to look into this matter and declare me the winner of that election immediately. I know the feeling of our people. I, I can't, as a matter of fact, it's my election, I contested that election. But I can't assure that our people are not going to, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know rise up against whoever wants to truncate the election in Udain. So what, what actually could be the outcome now is what I can't say, what I can't say. What I can't predict.